This round scheduled for six rounds in the Super Bantamweight Division. Fighting on the blue corner, wearing red, green, black trim. Official weight, 121 pounds. From TV Basket Stable, Limon Albay, ladies and gentlemen, Richard Vasquez. And his opponent in the red coat, wearing black with white trim. Official weight, 120 pounds. Professional record stands at seven wins, two wins coming by way of knockout with no defeat from Johnny and Lorde, Stable of Paranyaka City, introducing Juan Miguel Elorde. The three judges for this contest, Engineer Greg Ortega, Romulo, and Attorney F.P. Almeida. Young Reverend Charles of the Action, Virgilio Garcia. Our third man in the ring is uh, referee Virgilio Garcia. Boy Villanera forgot to give the record of Richard uh, Vasquez, the opponent of uh, Miguel Orde. Well, let me tell you, he's got one win, seven losses, one draw, and one knockout. His last fight he lost by a KO in the third round versus Virgil Nebran. And Lorde, on the other hand, won his last fight by a first round KO over Anthony Balubar. It was a fight we covered on the main event. Lorde, the fighter in the black trunks, Vasquez in red with the black trim down the side. Lorde is a good boxer. I've been watching him work out at the gym, the Johnny Lorde gym in Roosevelt uh, Avenue in Quezon City, where Manny Pacquiao was training. He was training there too. Megan Bai, the brothers. The, uh, the grandsons of the late great Gabriel Flash Lorde should be an easy, easy task for Miguel Lorde to get rid of Vasquez. He's a very intense young man. He trains very hard. Does his road work every morning, very faithfully. Works out in the gym. He's got a passion for boxing, no question about it. Uses a nice left jab to break through Vasquez. Tried to double up with the right. Good left hook to the body. Doubled up the left hook. And a hard right to the side of the body. Good combination and Vasquez is in trouble. <laughs> Alorde jabbing with a left. Looks very much like his grandfather. The, the looks. Flash Alorde, of course, was a southpaw. Reigned as world junior lightweight champion for almost seven and a half years. We covered several of his fights and what a fighter he was. Lorde coming and working to the body. Good left jab, snapping the head of Vasquez right back. Third man in the ring, Virgilio Garcia. Good double up. Three left hooks by Lorde. Double up the left and then came through with the right hook. We expect him to be able to move up and get better, better opponents, worthier opponents down the road because he's not going to improve unless he meets some really, you know, really competitive fighters. Vasquez faking twice, not throwing a punch, then to a right and missed. The Lord David, a three-punch combination. Vasquez sneaks in a right hook. You know, we've seen Vasquez fight before, the Inara Center. His record actually is not quite fair to him. He's, he, he fights. He, he's a fighter. His one win, seven loss, one draw record doesn't do him justice in that sense. But Elorde, obviously, is a much better fighter. He's undefeated and uh, he's got good hands. Final 10 seconds of round number one. 
Vasquez is able to survive this first round, which is a credit to him, if nothing else. There goes the bell in the round number one. We're going to take a quick break and come back in a moment. This portion is brought to you by Tandwai, the number one rum. This portion is brought to you by Tandwai, the number one rum. Some of the slow mo action, you see the combinations by Lorde. Little short there, then a right straight. That was a good punch. Caught uh, Vasquez flush on the face. We'll be moving into round number two. This is a battle in the Super Bantam Weights. Uh, it's scheduled for six rounds. Miguel Orde in the black trunks against Richard Vasquez in the red with the black trims down the side. We're moving into round number two. The third man in the ring, referee Virgilio Garcia. Elode. Trying to fake, Vasquez comes in, Elode ties him up. We're coming to you from the Elode Grand Ballroom, the Flash Grand Ballroom here in Sukar Paranyake in the Elode Sports Complex. And Miguel Elode in the black trunks looking to throw a big punch but using the left to set it up the left jab hard right to the side of the body by uh, Elorde Vasquez takes the punch missing Elorde is uh, also has to cut the distance a little bit is a little too far out and his punches are not really connecting with that kind of power that he would like to have behind those punches because he's a little too far off. Jabbing with the left. Oh, beautiful right hook by Elorde. That was a great punch. But Vasquez took it and he's still standing. Another left hook by Elorde. Doubles up with the left. Left to the side of the body and to the side of the head. Body shot again. Now the crash of heads. Lord they grimacing, taking a look at that. Well, he's ready to continue. Says Miguel Lord and referee says, let's get it on. Good left. Lord has a reach advantage and a height advantage against Vasquez. But he hasn't been able to put him away. Despite his impressive seven wins no losses record with two knockouts he's not a tremendously heavy puncher but he can punch Miguel Orde. this is round number two of a fight that's scheduled for six oh good double up again with the left hook he's very good with that left hook and again the heads clash Vasquez comes with his head low Winding down round number two of a fight that's scheduled for six. Miguel Ode getting those body shots, thundering into Vasquez. Vasquez moving around, trying to stay away. Not a good left. Doubles up with the left and a right. There goes the bell in the round number two. Slow mo action there you saw that good left to the top of the head and another left by Elorde good successive punches then as Vasquez held him he threw a right there goes the bell end of round number two you're taking a look at Miguel Orde in his corner Tanduai, the number one rum. Uh, good friends from Tanduai, Paul Lim, and of course, Mr. Andres Ko. Thank you for your support through the years for the main event. We are moving into round number three. Miguel Ode, the fighter in the black trunks. Richard Vasquez in red. 
Elod has had the better of the exchanges so far in this fight, taking the first two rounds on our unofficial scorecard. Vasquez cautioned by referee Garcia. He's told to break, and he throws a punch in the break. Vasquez also sometimes <laughs> has some antics, which the crowd, oh, perfect right hand. Flush it. And Vasquez shakes his head, <laughs> taps the side of his face, and says, that didn't hurt me. Elorde, looking for the opening, jabbing with the left. Vasquez goes to the body, to the left of his own. Elorde is not having things all his own way in this fight. I mean, he's not as dominant as he thought he would be. He doubles up to the left and a good right again by Mick Elorde. Vasquez now backing off and running away. Good left again to the body by Elorde. The left hook is a real damaging punch of Elorde. And Vasquez holding. Lord, they continue to stop. Connects with another good right and a left. But Vasquez fighting back desperately more than anything else. And Lord, with a good right to the body again. He's working to the body quite well. Miguel Lord. Stop Vasquez. Holding. The Lord, they're trying to measure him with the left and waiting to throw the right, setting him up. But Vasquez dances away. Hard drag right to the side of the body and the left. And Vasquez is holding very clearly. We're coming to you from the Flash Grand Ballroom, named after the late great Gabriel Flash Elorde. His grandson is in the ring right now, Miguel Elorde, son of Johnny and Lisa Elorde. Hard right to the side of the body and a good right straight. But Vasquez survives, bobbing and weaving. Nearing the end of, of round number three, that was the bell end of the round. We're going to take a break and come back in a little while. This portion is brought to you by Tandwai, the number one rum. This portion is brought to you by Tandwai, the number one rum. Some of the slow-mo action of that previous round. You saw Elordi coming with the left, but Vasquez was ducking under and avoided, and he was holding very clear. Look at him gripping the hand very clearly. That's holding. There goes the bell. As the action continues in this six-round bout, this is round number five. Sorry, round number four. Brought to you by Tanduai, the number one round. This is your main event coming to you from the Flash Lord Day Grand Ballroom here in Suplat Paranyaki, the Lord Day Sports Complex. You've got a pretty good crowd out here. The Lord Day trying very hard to put this Vasquez away. But he hasn't really hurt him. He's, he's caught him a couple of times with some really good body shots. But he hasn't, doesn't seem to have hurt him very much. Good left again by him. And Lord, they're continuing to stalk Vasquez. Vasquez retreating. He's not fighting back, really. He only gets, he fights back only when he's pinned. Stalking Vasquez. Covers up with the left. Another flurry by Elorde. Vasquez covers up. Gets caught again. Elorde is able to sneak the left right through the defense of Richard Vasquez. Elorde trying very hard to put him away, but not very successfully so far. Oh, 
perfect punch. That shook Vasquez. No, no question about it. And Vasquez sort of mocking a lot and a lot of keeps him, then goes after him, and that's holding. Oh, another flurry by a lord and a beautiful right hand. Vasquez is in trouble, trying not to show it, but he is in trouble. A lord is jabbing with the left, waiting to throw the right hand again. Vasquez steps forward, throws a wild right hand. Elorde leans back. Elorde sneaks in two good right hands to the side of the head. Final 10 seconds of this round. And Vasquez has survived another round against Miguel Lorde. There goes the bell end of round number four. Slow more action of the previous round, brought to you by Tanduai, the number one round. That was two good right hands, solid right hands by Miguel Orde. But uh, it didn't rattle Vasquez too much. He survived, and he survived four rounds so far against Miguel Orde. Richard Vasquez, a record of one, seven and one with one knockout. He's got one win, seven losses, one draw, and his only victory came by way of knockout. And Elorde, on the other hand, is undefeated in seven fights with two knockouts. Round number five of a fight that's scheduled for six. This is the penultimate round. Elorde in the black trunks. Vasquez in red with the black Strike down the side, oh, another hard, good right by Elorde. Vasquez is in a survival mode in this fight. Rarely fighting back, unless he's cornered. And it's Elorde who's been carrying the fight to Vasquez, but hasn't been able to really hurt him. He's caught him with some good shots, but not really hurt him. Vasquez misses completely. And Lord, they could have counted, but he was a little too slow in reacting to that situation. Well, we'll be honest with you, this is a young kid. Still a long way to go. But right now, he's nowhere near the skill of his Lolo, his grandfather. Gabriel Flash Elorde. What a wonderful fighter he was. He was a terrific human being. Unbelievable. Now Vasquez is getting nailed with some big body shots from Elorde. And he's holding. And referee Garcia should deduct a point. I don't understand. You cannot hold this way. That's against the rules in boxing. Elorde getting a little desperate. Trying to win big, Vasquez misses with the right. <laughs> Lord is caught him with some really solid shots, but it hasn't. Uh, Phased Richard Vasquez. Good right straight again by Elorde. The right straight is connecting time and time again, and the left hook to the body. Vasquez walked into that right hook. Vasquez comes and throws a right. Final 10 seconds of the fifth and penultimate round in the sixth round super bantamweight battle. There goes the bell, end of the round. 
We're going to take a break and come back in a moment. This portion is brought to you by Tandwai. Then. Hello, day continuing to work to the body, but it hasn't been. He hasn't been able to really weaken uh, Vasquez, Richard Vasquez. He's still standing there and taking punishment in the corner of Elordi, his uh, dad, Johnny Elordi, and there's also William De Velos. We're moving into the sixth and final round from the grand ballroom here at the Elordi Sports Complex in Sukhar Paranyake, the final round. Mig Elordi in the black trunks, Richard Vasquez in red. The Lord has won every round on our unofficial scorecard so far. But he'd like to end with a flourish and try and put Vasquez away. Look at that embrace. You know, they must be getting really frustrated. This is not his kind of fight. Ulo then. And he's, he's, you know, his timing is a little off. Vasquez rushes forward, doesn't throw a punch. Chance for Elode to counter. Good stringing left jab by Elon. Garcia warning Vasquez about the use of his head. Time is running out on Miguel Ode. A minute and about five seconds remaining in this fight. Sort of uh, kibitzes here at ringside. They want ba Vasquez to fight, but he's nearly not doing anything very much. And he just mm, just b charges into the Lord and he's holding hand and then puts his head forward. You should. Elode probably would have been better if he threw an uppercut, but he hasn't thrown a single uppercut in his fight, and his fight's almost over. And Vasquez dances away. There goes the bell, end of the round, end of the fight. And I know Miguel Orde is very unhappy that he couldn't put this guy away. This portion is bought by...